tips and like what makeup they do. So like femme style, they do foundation, then a brows, wing shadow. And then on the male side, they do what they do to like make them look more masculine. But I think that it helps someone else who maybe might feel like they're gender fluid, if that's correct. I might be incorrect and I apologise on that behalf, but... And I think it's quite inspiring to see that, you know, if you're feeling in that sort of category that you think you are gender fluid and you don't really know what gender you are sometimes. That's a really nice way to make yourself feel more included and find yourself, I guess. Oh, I was thinking that moustache is like really good. <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. Okay, so there's days, so I don't obviously know too much. I'm not knowledgeable to, well, I'm not knowledgeable to know enough about gender fluid. But so they have two genders, either a male or a female. And it depends how they're feeling, how they get dressed, or makeup they're feeling to do that day. So here she's getting ready to leave, feeling very she and her, she looks very pretty. Her makeup looks insane. And then he looks, it's just unreal. It, the contouring, the moustache, the contouring on the nose, thicker eyebrows, the hair. He, he looks more like bulky. And like when you look at her, she's quite dainty and like sweet. I can't believe it, that's incredible. An orphan power of makeup and clothes. I mean, fair play, she looks insane. Thanks for watching Story Chanda. Don't forget to like and follow.